Fuck it. Let's try it again. Here we go. Hi. No. <laughs> I'm taking a picture of this turtle laying its eggs. Oh, okay. Yeah. But you're not, you can't be broke down, right? I got a 100,000 mile warranty and an OnStar on that, baby. Okay. Yeah. Call in front of you. You're not trying to get in there, are you? No, we just want to make sure you're okay. That's oh, no, I'm not okay. I'm a stable Vietnam vet. I haven't been okay since I left Vietnam. <laughs> yeah. I'm from Connecticut. I just started. Are you, you live up here? Have you moved up I'm here? I'm in the process, actually. Do you mind if I get a little video of you real quick? No, that's fine. And that's great wearing the orange. I, when I go, I'm going out in the woods right now. I got my dog. It's my boyfriend. He's actually uh, part of Project Black. Oh yeah, well it's great. I have a lot of. Oh, yeah, I don't know if you want to. It's you probably don't want to touch her. Yeah, I just want to see if she'd move. But. No, because she's uh, laying her eggs. Oh, it's wait. like if you would. Didn't you know she was laying her eggs? No. Oh I've yeah. Never seen a huge turtle before. This is a snapping turtle. In fact, she could have bitten your finger. So oh. please. Yeah. No, uh, I've seen this before. I even put a video. Of my, it's Roger Nam Vet. On YouTube. On YouTube? I'm going to have to look that up. Yeah, and I have one I put, and about 20,000 people looked at it because they played it on, they played it on um, CNN, I report at one point. So it doesn't say 20,000 on YouTube, but it's, they played it on a Sunday morning, and it's this funny little thing where I'm escorting the snapping turtle across the road. Uh, I think it was back there. And a lot of times they'll cross the road, lay it in the we sandy saw soil. One last week on our way to Holton. Yeah, these are snapping. Keep your f fingers away from the front. You can pick them up by the shell around the side. Oh. And the southern alligator snapping turtles can't do that because they can, they can get around and bite you on the side of the really? shell. Oh, these guys can put a crimp in your finger. I didn't know that. Oh yeah, but huh? Yes. Yeah, no, no, that's the alligators. These can't. Well, I thought Those are the southern alligator snappers. Yeah, awesome. And also, she, because she just re reached over, she didn't know it was it was laying eggs, and she didn't know it was a snapper, and she just gently touched the knee. And, that's uh, surprise. But but you know she's she's right now. Is that a snapper or just a regular turtle? No, it's a snapper, but it's a northern snapper, not the one they have down south, which can reach around to the tail almost. Uh, these guys, you want to pick up. You can pick them up by the side of the shell. Uh, the, you know, awesome. these, the, the snappers um, down south, alligator snappers, you have to grab one here under the shell underneath the head and the under at the tail. And that's the way you can do that. Hey, and so I've been up here 15 years in New Jersey. I, oh, you're really? just working up here then. Yeah, you're getting bitten. I am oh, too. Yeah, but I got plenty of bug spray in the car, but I didn't bother. <laughs> Hey, you mind if I get you? I'm going to put you on YouTube. I'm Roger Nomvet on YouTube. Uh, and and your wife and you, well, you'll be part of the video, but it's... Yeah. So we're, are you just working up here temporarily? Oh, no, I'm originally from Danforth. Oh, you've seen this a million times. Oh, yeah. 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 Actually, I'm <laughs> actually yesterday coming down Route 2. Oh, yeah. I a great big one. I was going to turn around for her. She's like, oh, we can take it home for a pet. And I'm like, no. No, well, you could take it home, but it would be, I think I don't know, it might be, I don't know if it's legal. But you can take it home and make a great stew out of it. I, and there you go. There's two other places right in front of you where other snappers, I think, have just laid their eggs. That's awesome. I'm glad you're happy. I'm glad because I know when I came up here, I w I'm still excited after 15 years. I know. And she's going to cover that up and then go back down there and eat some more fish and ducks. And really? They eat baby really? ducks, fish, you know, they eat anything they can. Huh? Those are probably both her spots. There's one right behind you, too. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Thanks a lot. I'm going to zoom in on that. There you go. I'm telling you, there's another spot. This is the time of year, and I think in a month or two they'll be coming out and crawling down there. Another one right up there. Oh, there you go. Look at that. Over on that yeah. 
No, Eaton, I, I have one on the internet that ha uh, had a lot of views. Yeah, yeah. Really? But that was on CNN I report because they showed it on Sunday morning when they didn't have anything else to do. And what, what that was, was... Uh, you can send it into Channel 5 and they do that. Uh, yeah, that you can send it in. She can send this in. I don't, I won't... That's awesome. Yeah. Coming and, from Connecticut, like it's no, I know the mu You know, I hit a moose a, uh, a week or two ago, I and haven't seen one yet. Oh yeah, it was a baby one. Uh, no, a yearling. It was half the size of a moose and twice the size of a deer. A big eighteen wheeler was coming at me up here, about mm -hmm. five miles up that way, and I'm going this way. And all of a sudden, the thing dances in front of us. <gasps> I just clipped the 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 uh, butt of it, and it was alive. I didn't kill it. Coming this way? Yeah, it's coming this way, and the 18 wheelers coming this way. All the lights in my face, I couldn't see it, huh? Was it morning time? 10 o'clock at night. Oh, yeah. It could be any time. I saw one come out in front of traffic down there by Callis at 1 in the afternoon. It's the, mo I, it's the most amazing. I see a moose, we gotta go find one. I'm like, you don't go hunt moose, you just go out and you see. You just drive around. Drive around on some of these roads here, you know, the ba these Baskahegan Forest Roads. That'd be awesome. And I come down Route 2 to where the pit walk. Just. From Linnaeus, where the family's restaurant is, down to where we turn to go like, over to April, right there in Hainesville. I've seen three there, and I've seen four more from there down to the Just gr drive out on Chuck's Road at night. Oh, tonight. And about 10 or 15 miles out there, you're bound to see a few. That's awesome. Are the twins still out there? I haven't been down Chuck's Road in a long time. I don't go down Chuck's. I go down another I'm road. For the last couple of years, I come around with coming from out on Skillinger one day. Yeah. And we're just like, wow, we ain't seen no moose here. And all of a sudden, I'm like, oh, there's one. And I see, and then they're made to be dropped. Right don't worry. <laughs> Then another one come right up beside it, and I'm like, I wonder that. By the way, I'll get, give you a hint. Uh, you'll get better reception. You have a little thing, a plastic protective case, which you need. Yeah. But if you get poor reception, just take it off, and you'll get better reception. I didn't know that. Yeah. <laughs> Especially here. They just put this new tower up in Danforth. It's yeah, down, down there a bit. Yeah. Rising, no, huh? That's rising. Well, I don't care. You know, it could be. I can't control that stuff anyway. Oh, no, so, I got U.S. Cellular. If you get U.S. getting poor reception. That's the next thing I would get. <laughs> oh. right yeah, U.S. Cellular, you'll at least get a signal up here. <laughs> and you could just peel that off if you're not getting one in. With that off it. Huh? Yeah. Just the case off, baby. We'll get a little bit better. Yeah, and you can even try that now. Why, why mess around? Maybe it'll work okay with what you have. I don't know. Hey, I'm glad I met you guys. My name's Roger. I'm Mallory. Mallory, and your name is? Sam. Sam, nice to meet you. Well, thank you. Man and wife, I guess? Just about. Okay, I mean, yeah, okay. You guys are about the same age. You're together as a partners and I stuff. I moved up here at the beginning of April. She come up in May. But you grew up here, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, That's really cool. Good. You got all the experiences, man. Oh, yeah. It looks like you like Bermuda. <laughs> uh, my mother and then went on a cruise. Yeah. Did they? One of the things you brought me back. This is what I like about my camera. It does selfies, oh, so I go, hi, <laughs> you know, like I need yeah. it so you can see yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's awesome. ways. Hey, I'm going to get in there and I'm going to put on some bug spray. Yeah, it's yeah, it's enjoyable, 